Hello, ladies and gentlemen, and I know I've been just kind of spamming these wrestling news is like crazy today. I apologize, but um, this is another. This is probably one of the biggest news um, today. Um, that is pretty interesting, and I really have some opinions about it on how this would go and how this would work. But um, if you've been knowing lately on WWE. Raw Paul Heyman has been mentioning The Undertaker for about two weeks now. And also Undertaker, there's been pictures of Undertaker getting, uh, obviously he's been getting, you know, he's been working out and getting ready. Some people believe that he was just getting ready for WrestleMania 32. He was working out for WrestleMania 32. Um, but now we're getting word that The Undertaker could possibly well the biggest rumor right now is Undertaker is returning Sunday night at Battleground um which is really interesting because uh obviously I think I know how this would go um so I'm gonna share my opinions on how I think this is gonna go and you you know leave your feedback if this is true obviously I think that Undertaker is returning to avenge his brother Kane after what Brock Lesnar did to him, uh, injuring his ankle, and after Brock Lesnar ended his streak, I think Undertaker is coming back to possibly screw Brock Lesnar, having Seth Rollins retain, and Undertaker would go on the feud with Brock Lesnar, which this would probably most likely feud in to SummerSlam 2015. Now, where would that leave Seth Rollins? Uh. I don't know, it's kind of hard to say. Probably, this probably will mean that this will be the end of the whole... I'm thinking maybe this will end the rivalry with Bray Wyatt and Roman Reigns, and we could see Roman Reigns versus Seth Rollins at SummerSlam. Like, we have a good five weeks to work with this, so if it does go the route, storyline-wise, they have time to develop that storyline, so it's believable. So we could see Roman Reigns versus Seth Rollins at SummerSlam, if that's the way I think it's going to go. So we could see Seth Rollins versus Roman Reigns for a main title, and we could see Brock versus Undertaker, a rematch after Su Brock Lesnar defeated the Undertaker streak. So for Undertaker, this could be getting revenge for his brother and getting redemption after you know losing his streak to Brock Lesnar. So two things to why this could be happening. Storyline-wise, yes, it makes sense, but it's it would kind of be out of nowhere, and I guess it would be surprising. Maybe if I didn't know about it, maybe he didn't post it about it. Maybe as su Sunday, if I saw this, this would be super, super shocking. But again, this is just small little news. Don't really know if this is 100% true. I guess we won't really won't know if this is 100% true till Sunday. But this is the biggest news going on right now. Uh, that in between, you know, Ryback's injury. Um, so we it, it, it's a hit or miss right now for me. Of if this is true or not, but let me know in the comment section if you think this is true or not, and let me know how you think the storyline will develop, or you know what will Undertaker be doing, or whatever. So leave a like and subscribe for more wrestling news at the John Seventy One Thousand Twenty Rob.